Hey guys, how's everyone doing? This is Paul here, and before we get started on this fabulous um, game session of Fable Buff, I want to know that um, this was having a pretty much experience and fun that I ever had beforehand. I really did enjoy it. I had a couple of uh, foot I'm playing with new people. Um, I had um, like good time understanding the story of the same. We were doing the fall, the Star Festival for Lion Fiddlecraft and so on too. And it was pretty fun, very good, and we had a good time. I even recorded the session of it and actually. Got the whole cast voicing over the stuff that I had beforehand, though, and so what I do, there was there was a lot of nice people there that play this game, and I had a good time enjoying it. I had a good time playing it, and I also had a good time just. Do what I do best in these type of game situations where technically you don't, um, you have fun and you do what you want to do for that matter. And <sighs> excuse me, and I did enjoy that beforehand though. This might be the very first episode that me and my friends, new friends, play these people craft scenes for that matter. And you want more of this, let me know in the comments down below. I would love to hear your thoughts about this because let me know, um, for that matter, I did enjoy playing the game and I did enjoy having fun. So, if you want more of this, let me know in the comments down below. I would love to hear your thoughts. But until then, um, this is Future Paul signing off with the gameplay of Fiddlecraft. Enjoy. Welcome to Mythos. 1,000 moon turns ago, an event known as the Shattering destroyed the world as people knew it, redistributing magic into everyone and everything. The Mythos of today is a wild, vibrant, and magical place, and it's here in the Long Meadows that you'll begin your adventure. These rolling plains are defined by expansive, undulating hills that stretch out as far as the eye can see. At night, bioluminescent grasses glow and breathtaking starfalls are a regular occurrence. Travel across the meadows is aided by cairns along the roadside, piles of star fragments that ward off monsters and ease the burden of all who pass. Away from the roads, the grasses grow tall and wild in areas known as the fallows. All manner of creatures are said to lurk within. You wait outside the wandering vine tavern and prepare to meet the tall grass pride. A light breeze sends ripples dancing across the grass and fills your lungs with fresh morning air. Dawn is breaking. An adventure? The six caravan convoy of the tall grass pride pulls to a halt outside the wandering vine tavern. Pride leader, Dill Tallgrass, hops down to greet you. Dill is an athletic man in his 60s with amber eyes and grey shoulder-length hair. His face bears the blue pigment shared by all Longstriders, which reflects the sky under which they were born. Well met, friends. I'm Dill Tallgrass, leader of the Tallgrass Pride. And you must be the mages joining my caravan. How about a round of introductions? Now you guys introduce your characters. <clears throat> You can make it up as you go. Okay. Um, my name is Serana, and I am a long strider elementalist. I am here to help because that's what I do. Because you want to protect nature. Yes, nature is the most important thing to me.
Uh, who's next? Uh, well, my name is Salaya, and I'm a sage. All I know is, all I've learned is from books, and I love to read a lot. Okay, and Odin in fear, I uh, laugh. Mm -hmm. Well, go ahead and introduce your character. Now, I would take you to Odin in a fire. Uh, Are you guys there? Odin, R. Oh, four. Okay, sorry. But we're introducing our characters. I got, I got distracted by something. Well, go ahead and introduce your character. As far as my character, uh, my, the character's name's Olaf, and he's a woodland, a woodlander. He's also a merchant. I'm not, not really too stressful about him, but you know he'll he'll be here any any way, shape, or form, and sell any goodies or try to buy any good, goodies that we need. Okay, and lastly is a uh, well dumb a uh, dumb thing. Far. Uh huh. Uh, far, you here? I think he died or got abducted by aliens. Or they. <laughs> Something happened. He's probably trying to talk to us, but something's going on with Discord. Who, who are we trying to talk to? Far. Too far. Far. Oh, okay. I know you're. Or we're talk We're saying far, not you, Paul. What? Dio, what are you doing? He Come died. Here. Oh, he probably yeah, died. He, on until he, he died before back. he died before we could even get started. <laughs> yeah. Well, <laughs> oh, while we're waiting on him, I'll be right back. You want to skip him for now? Hold on. Just listen to the Uh, sorry, I had to get up oh. first. Oh, okay. oh, there you are. Yeah, sorry about that. That's okay. Well, it's no your turn to introduce your character. Ah, uh, you will see Wrong person. <laughs> around six foot five, rather odd individual, uh, covered uh from about shoulder down in really thick bronze plate armor. Uh, it seems as though plants seem to grow through the intertwining bits of the armor. And um, he has a very low dim glow to his eyes of green glow. He seems to be kind of just making sure everyone's like on the lookout for anything that could potentially be harmful to any of the passerbyers. Okay. Get good check if everyone's here. Because some people were went to do some stuff. I'm here. I think. I think Odin. I think Odin's not here. He should be here. Mm -hmm. well, he said he went to use the bathroom. Oh, I didn't hear that. I'm sorry All about right. that. Suddenly had to get I'm back. Go. Oh, welcome, welcome back. back. Okay. Okay. A deal called a deal talk is going to show you guys your contract you agreed to. Let me know when you start reading. Can anybody not read cursive? I can read it to them. 
This isn't cursive, this is just fancy font. Well, it is fancy font, but some people can't read this. Yeah, true. It's weird, it does have some bits of cursive. Yeah, like if you're dyslexic, like my fiance is dyslexic, this would fuck him up. Because he's like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> uh, I do have ADHD and I am autistic. Uh, um, only twenty uh, gold pieces each. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I'm high functioning autistic with uh, ADHD. Uh, yes. I have uh, autism as well. I have high functioning, but. Uh, Central auditory processing disorder. Sounds can yeah. make me lose track. Um, visuals can make me lose track. <laughs> Would it be a oh, all... ADHD part? So we're all in the same boat. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> and we're rocking it. <laughs> Oh, so not rock the best where we sink ever. <laughs> We're trying to get all the, we, the we water just, out. We just cannot finish any enigmas if we have one. Yeah. <laughs> He's right. But are we, you can. All, we can do it. Are you all done reading? I am done reading. Yes, yes. I am done reading. Yeah, I'm good. Okay, next he's gonna show you the item you are protecting. Hmm. And a uh, long strider note, this is a gift by Lumos. Oh. Mm -hmm. So we have to escort this? To yes. the festival. Okay, to the festival. Pleasure to have you aboard. You'll be traveling on the rear caravan, the Dandelion. Head on back and let's hit the road. Um. An antlered woodlander with a sturdy build and dark brown skin sits atop the rear caravan. A sharp hooked blade glints in her hand as she carves a small figurine. She glances up from her work as you climb aboard, her expression. Okay. Uh, did you like, gonna ask where you guys are from? And... Hmm. She's gonna ask for, like, a past adventuring experience? That's the first time I heard that one. Yeah, it, she, it tells me to ask you uh, where you guys are from. You can either check where you're from, why you took the contact, or past adventuring experience. What kind of animal is that in my my profile picture for my character at Serana? Uh, uh, hold that on. is the timber wolf. No. Let me check. Uh, it's not a caramel cat or a timber wolf, she, but it's like what, what? a lion, maybe? What, what um, is she asking us? You. I'm asking the DM I, what kind of animal is in my profile picture because I'm trying to make up a, a uh, adventure, but I want to know what animal that is because I'm going to tell a story I, about the time I went to go get that animal. <laughs> no, I, like I a, meant. Okay. It looks like an oh. antelope. An antelope? Yeah. Mm. It has uh, characteristics of an antelope, yeah. Antelope. Okay. Uh, what was that from me? Uh, don't thing. I was actually, uh, don't think what he was saying. Oh, um. Storm Fang, so, uh. Um, uh yeah, that'd be Hulk. well done. Yes. Uh, in terms of the animal, from what I'm looking at here, it seems to have characteristics of an antelope, such as the body, but the tail seems more canine-esque. The face seems to actually have a cat-like muzzle. The actual face itself seems to have a bear-like overall yeah. skeletal structure. Those are goat ears, 
those are gazelle horns. Yeah, it's uh, a chimera. Of yeah, some sort. it's a kind of chimera. Yeah. Chimera. Uh, mm -hmm. in terms of exactly what it is, I don't know. This is a new creature. Never personally yeah. seen it. I could find any any creature is in the uh, characters I have. Why not call it a uh, a long grass gazelle? Perfect. Because, I mean, that seems to be the kind of theme for any kind of animal from that type of... And judging by the area that you're in, yeah. it's like yeah, a, I long, am a long grass. A wolf rider, a long strider, long strider, metal strider, whatever they're called. Yeah. Uh, and now for Odin, uh, Sephira, and Spiral Long. A uh, Spiral Long. Spiral Long, Odin, and I. Yeah. What? So he wanted to know what questions Dandelion was asking. Yeah. If I remember correctly, Dandelion was asking of what your what your past experiences are as an adventurer. Uh, and past adventure experience, where you're from, and why you took the contract. So where are you from? To, to me? Or to anybody. So uh, where you're from, to the party. Well, why did you take the contract and for, or give a past adventuring experience? A merchant actually, military experience. I actually have the same objective as my teammates since uh, this day I um, need money these days because reading books isn't really uh, giving money. Where I'm from, uh, technically I'm uh, I was born in the in the long windows like here. So Serana's gonna go into an experience um into a story about when she was I'll say like a couple years ago, she the village had gotten a long grass antelope and it had gotten out and escaped and she and um, other members of her village had to go track it down and bring it back to her village um, because they needed some form of hmm? item off of the, the long grass thing. I forgot it was a long grass gazelle as we called it. Yeah, long grass gazelle. We needed magical long grass gazelle milk or something. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it seems okay. like it grows oh. uh, herbs out of the top of its head there. There's actually yeah, a few actual herbs, creatures in IRL herbs. that grow specific plants in them. Well, if okay. it were, and it had uh, specific herbs we couldn't get in our region. And we needed okay. that. Ah, yeah. And now for Odin. Actually, I actually remember that. Y'all had to come to the merchant for that. I did, didn't I? <sighs> At least uh, one of you didn't. Never be in the area for that. I think it was. Had, had shop, you, shop you, there. I think my cousin was the one to talk to. Oh, yes. She's going to look over I remember and now. Yeah. Well, I mean, hey. far, far as where I come from, uh, you know, I ain't not special. Just grew up with old daddy there and. Yeah, in the merchant business and travel around looking for things to sell that could help make monies or, uh, you know, maybe turn this little road tra travel hustle here into maybe a uh, stay at home shop somewhere. Okay. Nothing, nothing too much. Uh oh. Why am I rolling, John? I do not know why I'm rolling, John, but okay. What? I don't know, I don't know why either. Uh, this is just to impress Dandelion. Uh, 
Ah. Oh. No okay. one's impressing Dandelion this time. <laughs> Why was mine at a two? A cuz. Yeah, boy, no, it, it showed he had a one. Yeah, mine was at a two as well. Yeah, well, I would have succeeded that if mine wasn't at a two. Wasn't at a two. Uh, it was because uh, she takes uh, more interest to guardians. Uh, uh, I'll actually hmm. go into talking about since I haven't actually had the chance to say. Uh, my name is Wilden of the Stormfang uh, family. I'm out from in the deep woods nearest to the mother tree. Uh, whenever uh, uh, whenever my family started getting into the business of just being a part of the Deep Woods uh, Guardian Brigade, uh, just started, well, about a month ago, I was not the way I look now. I uh, wore darker skin before, and also not, as I point to my head, not a wolf. This is kind of new. Apparently mages have a, whenever they become a mage, they kind of seem to change in one way or another. As I would assume that you yourself are a mage, unless those horns are natural. I'm not that cultured. Didn't get out of the woods much. Hey, uh, Dandelion is unimpressed with all of you. And she doesn't... And she doesn't give you guys any gifts. Oh well. That would have helped us later, but whatever. No tin bees. You've spent we'll the majority this. of the day on the road. Just as the sun is beginning to dip below the horizon, you hear a long, low whistle from the front of the pride. One by one, the caravans grind to a halt. There seems to be trouble up ahead. Dandelion turns to you. Go and see what's happening, will you? We'll set up camp while this gets sorted. As you approach the front of the convoy, you see Dill standing next to a broken can at the roadside. Must have been the storm that rolled through a few days back. Dill says, shaking his head. We'll likely be here a while. Uh, do you guys want to investigate the broken can? Yes. I do. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah. I'll May as well try. Three dice for this. I better fucking succeed. Uh, <clears throat> thank you. Yay! Okay. Is everyone gonna succeed this? Yep. Fates take. Let's give. Yeah, everyone failed the last right. one, but succeeded this one. Like, fucking. Uh, you all. Be uh, between the small scratches on the dark fragments and the way to have fallen, you are all confident that this was no natural occurrence. Someone self taught this Karen, and you'd be wise to keep your wits about you. I'm gonna turn to Dill Paulgrass. Tell him. This is not natural. This was sabotaged. We need to keep an eye out. <laughs> I'll just like take this mo I'll take I'll just <laughs> <laughs> hmm. I'll just, just like take this moment and just pull this I'm just gonna be the be the merchant that I am. It's like would you like a uh Promotional uh, twenty percent off of my merchandise so whenever you like. I just pull out like a little parchment kind of like <laughs> offering, like one, like one to all, like four to all of you. I'm just thinking of you as the what you buying guy from Resident Evil Four. I the merchant. What you buying? Yeah. What you buying? Hey. 
Well, but I will tell Bill that this was a sabotage. <clears throat> well, he did charm you guys into buying something. I, I definitely didn't uh, buy anything. Well, it was more of like saying, hey, I'm like, do you guys want a voucher? Yeah, the charm will want to see if you got anyone interested. If it's just a voucher, yeah, no, I'll take it. But I'm oh, not yeah. signing a contract. <laughs> No. Take a voucher. Oh, no, no, no. No contracts needed. Unless you do work for me, of course, and only contract, then contracts are only needed. He usually has some good deals. He, like, he trades with my village a lot. He usually has some pretty good deals, I'll say. And she'll immediately take that voucher from you. Hey. <laughs> and, uh, and for, uh, Savilia, a Savilian, a Savilia, Savarian. Nirvana, just like the uh, chicken uh, chat room. Well, I've had there. two people take. I've had yeah. two vouchers taken. Okay. Yeah. 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 And I'll take a voucher. Uh, for Savarian, uh, uh, do talk as a just gonna brush off your concern, cause that's why you hired the party. Well, then I am going to post up near the, um, um, Starseeker. Okay. Uh, Dancing Lion is going to post you guys and ask if you guys want to play a game of feats. Are we near the Starseeker? Uh, you guys going to be at this campfire. Uh, I would assume that the yeah. Star Seeker is in his cat, his wagon right here. As yeah. well as asking to clarify. Yeah, the Star Seeker is in a box in one of the caravans. But it's not this one next to us, is it? No. Hmm. I just like, you, you just like, no longer notice the merchant was around. He just vanishes. <laughs> Like, okay. all, all you see is, like, on the floor in front of y'all, just one promotional 50% off to the group. I grab uh, it. <laughs> I grab it. <laughs> uh, I was gonna tell you guys the mini games. Okay. Uh, do push- uh, do push up for 30 seconds, speak in a silly accent for the next 10 minutes, empty out your bag and tell everyone to decide, Perform a short rap about one of your fellow mages. Lick your elbow. Act as though you don't. Act as though you don't understand your language and speak up, but made a wank when you're dead for the next ten minutes. Or give the fellow mages embarrassing secret or guilty pressure. What was the last one? Give the fellow mages embarrassing secret or guilty oh. pressure. Guess your fellow mage is embarrassing secret or guilty pleasure. Uh, what is the, um... Fuck, there's so many options, I just forgot. At this point, three, seven. What? Wait, what, what is happening right now? Right now? Uh, mini games. Okay. I... Uh, uh, you guys get to choose from one through seven. I uh, will uh, try the. Uh, you want to do, do number four? What? Uh, I want to know what is first. Hey. Uh, perform a short rap about one of your fellow mages. Uh, which one's about the bag? About dumping out your bag. Uh, number three. Uh, was the whole thing dumping up your bag and explaining what's in it, or...? Uh, empty out your bag and tell everyone what's inside. Oh, tell everybody what's inside. Okay. I'll do number three, but wait, uh, someone else had a question first. I was okay. going to do the, uh, push-ups one. Okay, he's gonna okay. push up. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go with the 
uh, what's inside? Or I'll yeah, with num oh, right. go with number three. Uh, you want to do a silly accent or a made up language? I think Paul. Uh, uh, Paul? Yeah, he's doing a silly language. What's. Uh, Hold on. These are happy. Hello. Hey. I'm gonna dump out my bag and I'm gonna explain what's in it. Okay. <laughs> Yay. And what is? A spoiler log doing. Eh? Um. Me? Yeah. yeah. Uh, um. I'm actually w wondering what what's happening right now. We uh, are mini games. Yeah, we're doing mini games. Oh, mini games. Or... Uh, what what mini games are, are we playing right now? So sorry. Uh, uh, there are seven options. options. Okay, tell me the the options. Uh, hold on. A do push up for 30 seconds, speak in a silly accent for the next 10 minutes. What, what was the first one? I, I'm sorry. Do push ups do for 30 seconds, speak okay. in a silly accent for the next 10 minutes. I, I can do it. I can do this one. The silly accent? Okay. <laughs> like, it's like my. my Any silly yes, accent? I, yeah. Well, I can speak like this. However, I gave like. you a bro pop. <sighs> yeah, just I have to see who passed and failed. Paul passed, I passed, and so did um Paralog. I won. Okay. Okay, for uh for well done. Uh, you start strong, but face plant into the grass after a few seconds. Don't worry, you probably have lots of other talents. <laughs> I'm also doing heavy push-ups and about 50 pounds <laughs> with llama. Well, for Paul and uh, Severia, Serana, uh, Serana, your performance is unmatched. Make a wish upon. Make a wish and claim glory. I wish for a timber wolf. Uh, hold on. Uh, for a uh, Sephiria. Uh, you bear it all and now you get to make your wish. And for Olaf, fine, keep your secrets. Your air of mystique, you has been preserved. Okay, so three of you, you can make a wish. So Paul, myself, and Sparalog. Yeah. What? Oh, you want something to write on? I want a timber wolf. I can't give you that right away. <laughs> what I, wish? I'm willing to wait. <laughs> yeah, you get to make a wish, Bob. Anything. Uh, I make for a wish. Yes. Yeah. Um. I wish to study more of plants. Uh, not you, Far. I, Bob. Oh me. Yes, far. Uh, I wish to have a a nice a nice bowl of like uh, soup. Good soup. Good, yes, good, good soup. soup. Maybe with some vegetables. Good vegetable soup. It's my wish. 
That's my wish to the gods. Oh, I forgot the silly accent. I just went over to the Serena with her, like, if you can throw in a good ham, I'll give you something <laughs> <Yes>. for it. <laughs> <laughs> He'll pay for it. <laughs> What the? What, what did they just got? <laughs> <laughs> I just got weed. We can remind some weed. You'd be very fantastic over here. Uh, it Paul, like check your inventory. You know what I mean? Yeah. It blows my balls. I right, you. <laughs> you want some of the good stuff? Hmm. <laughs> um, I, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I you got. I do. Oh yes. Yes. Mm, but guys, um, um, have you like already eaten or not? Like, let let me prepare some things for you. Like, uh, I don't know. Uh, let, let me. Let me prepare the food for for you all, team, please. Sure. Trust me. I, sure. I trust you, fellow. Uh, <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> I, I like. I like wanna try to to make hey, uh, food like uh, with what I got with. lady of some sort. With like with this big old steak for me. item, <laughs> I want to use it. I want to use this item in the soup I'm gonna make. Okay. Okay. Is everyone gonna eat the soup? Yes. Odd. Uh, Odin, do you eat the soup? Yeah. And and far do you? I'll wait. And make sure everyone else is fed first before I get around to myself. Uh, they already ate, so I, it's only you left. And then yeah, no. If everyone's already eaten, I'll go ahead and get myself a bowl. Okay, then you all start laughing. Because <laughs> uh. Spawn had added a drop of bitters of mirth to your soups. Oh, uh, we're gonna have a good old time. This, this is why is this I specifically the, started was... to wait for this. <laughs> I waited specifically was... to avoid this. <laughs> this this <laughs> was, the was actually being. Guys. Don't you see? Now, now we are like a, a real, a real party because brothers and sisters have to like have fun together to be to have a good, uh, good, um, a good team. Uh, I could tell Teamwork you what is key. I could, I could tell you what Bitters of Murph does. Uh, don't, uh, yeah. I know what it does. I don't. Uh, when it, gets it, a, when it gets it, a few drops of this potion will make everything seem a little bit funny here. Consumer Tire Bottle will leave a person in hysterics for 24 hours. <laughs> oh, Damn. so it's we... Awesome. We didn't have the whole potion, we had a drop. Yeah. So yeah, it just means everything drop. seems a bit funnier. It's weed. Basically, <laughs> Basically yeah. I made space soup. I All made space soup. soup. It's good soup. Good soup. Good soup. Do you guys like my soup? I like your soup. La bonne soup de ma mère. I don't like particularly soup. like things being snuck into my food that much, I can tell you. La soup de moment. <sighs> yeah, I wouldn't piss off the wolf guy, though. Maybe you should tell him next time. Hmm. Oh. Yeah, let's roll. Oh. Hey! 
Yeah. Fuck yeah, everybody's going an epic success so far. Everyone's gonna see these motherfuckers. Oh, except, um... Uh, Fuddle off. Oh no. I only got, what, I got one dice? Everybody got two. Oh yeah, because it depends on your background you picked. Yeah, yes, it depends on your background. statistics. Yeah. Uh, for Olaf and Paul, there's nothing quite like sitting near a crackling fire and sunset, playing games with your friends. What a joy it is to be an adventuring mage. Well, for the other three, something moves in the shadows and catches your eye. Immediately alert hmm. everybody. Quickly, even though while you guys are laughing, <laughs> you can see the people in the shadows. I quickly draw out my uh, mace and shield. I also went fireball. Head. That's how big just... the room was. I said I cast fireball. Don't just cast but fireball. I'm a mage. We are the oh. we are in the middle of a. We're in the middle. Yeah. We're in the middle, and everyone. I don't care. Fireball. Hold on. Uh, no. Hold on. Uh, hold if on, guys. Like the whole place on fire. Uh -huh. Our literal thing. Hold on, guys. I'm What's gonna. Up? I'm gonna let it read along while you guys are with discussing. A shout of warning suddenly rises from one area of the camp, followed by a high-pitched whistle. An arrow thunks into the side of a nearby wagon. At once, several shadow bandits are upon you, their weapons drawn. Well, 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 what do we have here? A group of mages, is it? Looks like this will be a fun fight. Hmm. Uh huh. Uh, guess let me do stuff first. <laughs> Because Drift, you get to go first. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so there's these, these mother. Okay, the wolf and the two other people, the long striders. Mm -hmm. Who, Just, whose turn is this? Hold on, ah. let me uh, edit the tone order. No worries. Uh, so it's my turn? Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Yeah. But it is your turn. So hold on. Let me do the... Okay. So You've got the good to go. I... Alright, you can go now, Spar. Okay. Uh... I just mm -hmm. I'll be there I'll be able to Yes uh, oh no uh, if yeah. you you can move down with one while moving the token Yes yeah Yeah uh, uh, if you move down two you could have done fireball <laughs> No. <laughs> I sleep, guys. Yeah, I sleep, yeah. 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 Mm. Bye, bye. You guys will see as he runs up and. Quickly, uh, the ground underneath him shoots himself up and lands with a heavy thud. Spikes oh, growing out from the ground. Me. Yeah, they are not close. Oh, there's one motherfucker. Yeah, there's there. one motherfucker over there. Hold on. He's hidden. Uh, if you hover over the turn notice, you can see who's next. For the bandits. Yeah. It would be this one down oh, here, that, yeah. right below you. Yeah. 
No! Fuck oh. you! That was almost. <laughs> we just keep failing. Like every time we succeed, we fail, and then we succeed the next time we roll. Like, what the hell is this? Yeah. Their minions, they auto hit. Ooh, big slap. Yep, minions auto hit. Doing the same thing. Damn fucking fly, leave me alone! Ah, <laughs> oh, that's that's so fun. It's attracted to my mm. fucking new tattoos. A lot of flaming. Get down. This yeah. one this one here I, directly uh, to your left, yeah, to your left is going to act after you. Mm -hmm. Are they like? By the way, do, do they move by themselves, or is the GM moving them? The GM is. I move with the bandit. Okay, so okay, that's good. Hell yeah! Someone's got a hit. That will be, I think, more intelligent than any AI. Uh, I did yeah, 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 one bandit. <laughs> Do not, yes. But this one bit is just gonna sneak oh, well, away. I'm just gonna use Fuck that. I'm gonna guys. use that from now on. Oh, uh, he ran. He he ran away. No, he sneaked away. Oh. Uh, oh. Okay. He I sneaked caught him. away. <laughs> I think I'm like. Uh... I should need more than you just be like. Yeah, but they do not. We... <laughs> Are we like? Ooh. Do do we agree? Like there is no uh, how to say. We can't fire uh, on our teammates. There's no. no there is no okay. friendly fire. Okay. Yeah. Okay. The I was just. Uh, <laughs> okay. Yeah, there are some things that you have to arc through and uh, allies to make effects, like the radiant beam he just used. Okay. Only heals allies if you shoot through them. Hmm. The camp has been like attacked. <gasps> uh, is the 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 thing we are escorting? Uh, is but it you got like do, uh, okay? Or? Uh, you got to find one item from the de defeated bandits. What's that? <laughs> Uh, who's gonna collect it? I'll collect it. Uh, me? I- I think Odin's talking first. Okay. I'm a greedy bastard merchant. <laughs> Caravans are damaged and pride members tend to their wounded companions. Dandelion is busy helping to douse fires and repair caravans, but it's clear from the look she gives you that she's unimpressed with your work so far. Dill runs over to you, distraught. Our star seeker is gone. Oh, oh Lumos for like you. We can't turn up to the festival without it. Mages, please, will you help us to get it back? In yeah. terms of getting back the Stargazer, yes, we'll definitely, at mm -hmm. least I know I will, do not speak for the others, but... I'll be getting it back, this when we were contracted to get it to where it's going, and it's not going where it's going, so I need, we need to get it back. Yeah. Okay, you guys do have five options. Interrogate the defeated bandits, look at the death site, search for track, uh, tracks, check your surroundings, or question with this. Search for crack? Okay! I wanna want search for tracks as well. I heard crack. <laughs> It'd be a nature check, I believe. Yeah. I have three dice for these. Which you just passed. Yeah. The grass has been disturbed in a way that indicates the bandit fled south into an area known as 
the Falloth. Ben, it's went this way, guys. And I must, but let's check I'm around the surroundings as well. I want to also just kind of like scurry, kind of like scurry around a moment to um, try to like salvage any type of like armor or uh, any type of like gear to uh, try to like pick up and sell later on or use Double or fucking epic success. <laughs> and hold on, let me give you that bowl real quick. Um, the the object we were pro uh, escorting is it still there or have we lost no, it? No, it got it got stolen. Dang it! You don't find anything, Olaf. It got stolen. Well, for uh, the star secret was stolen. Hey, hey, what are, what are you <gasps> see if you all can uh, find can anything, I but uh, tell later on. Uh, hold on. Well, for Serena. Everything is watching the party intently. Once notices, it, it will fly the south. Can I? Oh, a bird. Does anybody and, uh, want to interrogate the. Uh, can I, like, uh. Commander? Let me. Give me a second to just. search up a word. What are we doing? Interrogating the defeated bandits? I don't uh, have the might for that. Uh, what was? I can definitely do that. Uh, what, what is what was Spy saying? Yeah. Me. Um. I. I, I mean, everyone is searching for, for the. I mean, uh, searching around. But I'd like to like uh, search. In, you know the, um, the the yeah, I don't, I don't the guys the that attack really. us. I'd like to search on them if they have something interesting or something that might uh, allow you to know who uh, planned this attack on us, maybe. I, so that would be... Yeah, that would be uh, interrogation. Yeah. And that's okay. what I was asking you guys wanted to do. Oh, yeah, I can do that. Yeah, sorry, I didn't understand. But yes, uh, that's what no I wanted worries. to do originally. No worries. We all talk it over each other, so. Empathy. Mm -hmm. Everyone but Paul, the bed, this bed that ain't no snitch. While for Paul, the bed will reveal that they, they work for the, an organization called the Blades. The Blades leader is a notorious criminal called Rue Nightshade. Well, I don't know who that is. She's a notorious criminal. Technically, your character would know. <laughs> no, I don't have any culture. Oh, Cultures, I identify it's... that. <laughs> that's true. That's true. You are. Okay I would not know that. <laughs> yeah, that is very fair. I guess I have a decent culture. I could potentially understand. Carvana would go up to you, would turn to everybody and be like, Well, with that information you gathered, we have to go south to track these people. It seems that's the way they went. We well, found the a first... track and a sentinel bird flying towards the south. Uh, it was a raven. Set, a sentinel raven. Uh, real quick, though, since we do have a prisoner here, mm -hmm. I'm just going to grab him. It was like, you're not going to enjoy this trip, but you're going to go back to where the authorities need you to be. I'm going to use this the spell in prison. Yes. Okay. I was just about to say. And this will send him to the authorities. Uh, uh, and, it, and it works. So it, it got, they got sent to uh, prison. The method of how he does this is once he grabs them and the spell is cast, the roots underneath the ground reach up, grab him, and just yank him through the ground. That's okay. pretty cool. Okay. He will get transported to the nearest by authorities. 
but he's going to go through hell going through there. <laughs> he's like, I'd rather die. Don't make me do that. He's going to show up there and just be covered in dirt. I was buried for like an hour. Um, <laughs> covered in dirt and trauma. Trauma. Sure. Um, is there? I mean, is there anyone that has been killed by the bandits or not? Uh, no one. No proud members were killed. Only okay. injured. Okay. And so, are uh, some of the uh, carriage we have we had are broken or something? Yeah, I, at the yeah. background, you can see them bent damage. Okay. Oh. <laughs> uh, I'd like like to enter in one of them. Enter in one of them and say, like, say loudly. Mm, maybe, maybe there's still someone hiding in there. And I just like search for, I don't know, objects, interesting ob objects. Uh, like, you find no one. Oh. Without the pride members. Yeah, I'm not searching people, I'm searching like... Uh, I know, stuff. I'm saying... I'm not, ah, I'm okay. saying... In the caravan, they are just pride members. No bandits. Mm. The bandits seemingly got what they came here for. I'd assume that they had prior knowledge of exactly where this object was. So they... And went to go claim it. They, they took... They took everything. Mm. I would assume they only that they... Only the Star Seeker. Yes. That's it. But they destroyed everything. No, they distracted okay. everyone. And took the thing that they came the here to The caravans are destroyed. Yes, and that was a part of the destruction. Uh, haven't, haven't, haven't we seen them, like, run away? Like, we, we are in a plane. It, 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 it's, yes. it's flat. They used, they used magic oh. to... Ah, okay, okay. Uh, sorry, I was, like... I was the... Uh, I was looking at the butterfly, so I, I couldn't see this. It, well, I mean, that is the purpose of magic. It is very hard to see. Uh, but yes, they had shadowy yeah. capes on them. I would assume that's also how they were able to sneak up on us mm. in this plane as well. Can I start one of the dead mm. bandits for a cloak? We have I, a I track. scream really we... loud. I scream really loud to explain my, my sadness. <laughs> I'm just waiting on you guys to go south or not. Yeah, no. I, I, we have the gold. I have the... Yeah. We have a little bit of information. Gold? And, uh, here, gold. I'll just look, uh, look over and be like, here, let me hold on for that for you. The gold. <laughs> what was that thing you picked up anyway? As I start getting ready to... I grab yeah. up my backpack and get ready to head out. Talking about this, this thing, I kind of like... Um, picked up kind of like a uh, what looked like some sort of like um, shadow aura with like some sort of red glowing rune on it oh yes or those. a symbol on it what is uh, it? Once, uh, once he equipped it you guys will notice that his colors become shadow edge with traffic that's probably how they did it then look at him he's melding into the shadows probably yeah, that's how probably they got hey. what exactly <laughs> does it do though is the real question. Oh, okay. Um, <laughs> what can it? Do I you mean, need far, to far, know? So, I mean, so far, far as like what I what it he reads far as for me, what it does is it like gives. It says it gives me uh, gain advantage on agility rolls. Huh. That's what it gate. That's what it's selling. That's like what it gives for me far as my on the roll. I believe agility. Like far as the whole like whole like. Power of what, like what the rune does. I don't get any other type of explanation for it. Uh, if you hover over it, you can do get information, yeah. which is about mm -hmm. the roll. Um, you can also click um, on it and bring it up to show everything. Guys, yes. Is there like something that we we need to know to? To find the the bandits back, or at least to find the the object we were I, protecting. I forgot that name. Uh, I by know way. that we need to go south, is where they went with the object, and we need to follow them that way and attempt to try to 
find whoever this rude nightshade is or wherever she's at because they have okay. the object because she's gonna she's gonna okay. get it one way or another but we just have to find I, where she's at i think we can at least manage to know if they are reachable like if if, if we can reach them now or if we have to walk a long way you know no, we, do. Walk, we just know we have to start I mean, having to walk this direction like I don't know. We'll, we'll walk however long it takes. Hopefully, not so long. Like we just gotta start in one direction. That's all I know. I'm gonna mess with it. Mm. So, are you all heading south? I'm ready to head south. I'm gonna. Oh uh, yeah. Go there with her. Go along with everybody. Uh, I, I'd like maybe to. I don't what know. the heck, Dad? Oh, can I? The the bandits, the the, the died bandits. Can I like take one of the one of their weapon? Uh, just to let you know, but uh, they are been teleported with their weapons and stuff to prison. Uh, I wouldn't have teleported oh, okay. them with their weapons. Uh -huh. I teleported. I kept those to the actual caravan <laughs> so they can continue to have themselves armed. But no, I mean, like they would get uh, taken away by the authorities. You sent them to. He's not able yeah. to give us the weapons as inventory items. Right oh now. no, no, I I know that. My character would have made sure that if their weapons were still here. He would have made sure that they were given to the caravan because they're going to be losing five mages. They need to arm themselves. I'm more upset that for Tar to. Gotcha. Ah, yeah. What is a bullet? A bullet. Bullet. A bullet. Yeah. Bullet. You all ready to go south? Are you an inventor? Brûlé. 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 I don't know, what was it? Something you put on We're sandwich? We're also on the deck, oh my god. Brûlé. Mm. <laughs> Isn't it like some know, like kind of it's animal? It's a kind of a creature called a bullet. Yes, a small animal. It would oh, really cute. That, that, that must be it, yes. Yeah, so we a need bullet. a bullet. <laughs> well, no, a bullet is a rather large creature that lives underground, normally encased in some kind of natural occurring metal. One of the burrows, hmm. yes. Well, it's quite dangerous. Guys, the more time we spend here discussing about bullets, why, no, why are, it's I've time been we, we're not Why haven't you? <laughs> uh? <laughs> I've been walking. No, I mean. <laughs> We we can walk, but but they are they are surely running, you know. Why yeah, aren't we let's, let's go. Uh, faster? Like I don't know about you, but we'd eventually reach up with them event in the same location. It's gonna take time for them to do whatever they're trying to do with that thing. I don't mm. even know what in the world they're trying I, to by do. By the way, what what, let's go. What, let's what, go. what was this this object? I mean, what was the purpose of this object, which I Still forget that name. What's the name of the object Star we were Seeker. carrying? Star Seeker. Star, Star Seeker. Se Star Seeker. Okay. It looks like some of kind of Star fancy Seeker. glowy. It's a fancy oh. glowy thing that we've been contracted to guard. It's a magic item sure. for, to do with. Yes, but, to do something with the festival okay. that's going on. I don't know for sure. Uh, once we got it back, I think I'd like to analyze it, just for uh, to know what what it is because. It's, uh, Okay. Well, let's go get it. Yeah. I cast fireball. <laughs> you can't just cast fireball. We're in a field. Cast it carefully. I cast mm. fireball. I'm gonna hit you with my mace. All right, let's go. <laughs> okay. No one talk. The thing. I just real. Yeah. I just realized the only weapon I have is a slot. The slingshot. I mean, I have. That's just like a thing I have as well. But that's just like something I had when I was a kid. Um, now you gotta play it for you guys. Darkness brings with it the three moons of Mythos, each taking their place in the clear night sky. 
Lumos, the bright moon, and Umbra, the large dark moon, peer down from their celestial thrones. The These power. two full moons are good omens in their own right. While Lumos provides guidance, Umbra wow. offers safety. However, the third my smallest moon of Venus, Tamas, like can be seen peeking the ground. out between the um, two. When um, not hidden by one of its you know, larger siblings, Tamas, a figure of chaos, heralds uncertainty and, in and in some and cases, actually, danger. If you head southward into the okay. grasses of the fallows, one thing is certain, when forging the path through the wilds of mythos, safety is never guaranteed. That ends session one. No, no. Y'all ready to continue on? Or do you want to stop? I'm letting you guys, do you guys want to continue or take a break? In real life or in, in the game? In real life. We've done basically what is equivalent to book one of the adventure path. Uh, I think I'd, I'd maybe like to take a break because it's a bit late. Yeah, you want to take a break, grab some food, go to the bathroom? Yeah, yeah. They're also, good. I believe they said earlier that they are in France. Yes, yes, it's uh, past uh, 12 p.m. I don't know. Yeah. Yes. Oh, so you guys, it's um, 12 in the night. Did you want to keep playing or do you want to uh, go to sleep? Uh, if, if I can take a sleep, I'd like to. But if you yeah, if you want to continue, continue. You, you can still continue without me. Maybe I don't want you to. I want to. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, yeah. We can totally do this with four people. I've done this a couple times, so yeah. I know what's gonna happen. <laughs> Let's say that my character has uh, stayed with the people to help them and uh, like heal uh, them from their injuries. I could. We can stop it right now, because I am also getting tired. Oh, okay. okay. We just wanna do it so we could continue time. next time, maybe? Yeah, yes. uh, let's make a group... a DM group chat, so we can see guys want to continue. Well, I mean, I could uh, yes, I do so have a server on my own, I can invite y'all to. Like, on, on Discord? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, yeah hold on. It, it um, does... It does keep track of the progress you make. Yeah, especially since you okay. can't be loading up the same story, so you won't have to worry about your character sheet or anything. We'll just have to. Yeah. Oh, so sure when we'll be back, we'll, we'll be we'll be there again. Yeah. We'll be starting yeah. up from I assume at this location. Okay. Um. Yeah. How do how do we leave then? Uh, right. Click, click on the F box. Yeah, and then exit. Uh, just, uh,